Hello Beauty News family, welcome to this week's episode of Get Swatched. This is a series where we swatch things and today we're swatching all of the Sailor Moon things. Not quite all, but most of. Most of. And it's very cute. Get ready. All right, guys. So we're doing a voiceover with this video. Let's get straight to the point because we had an audio snafu. Seems to be uh, the story of our <laughs> life since we got a very expensive new audio set up and it just keeps failing, <laughs> failing, <laughs> failing. Mayday, mayday, mayday. So we're doing uh, a little voiceover with this video. But essentially what we have here is an array of Korea Beauty Sailor Moon products. So Korea Beauty is a Japanese brand and they make some really beautiful Sailor Moon themed makeup products. And we do know a lot of our audience as oh. Sailor Moon fanatics. Yep. We get it. We do get we it. We understand. So this video is for you. It is. We hope you enjoy. First up, we've got the Sailor Moon Miracle Romance Powder. This is the flat style. So there's different type of packaging with some of the products that Korea Beauty make. But this is essentially a face powder. It has three different tones. In the shape of a crescent moon. With this powder, I swatched each individual shade and then I mixed all of the shades together and swatched it. Um, I would say the sections of the pans are a little bit too small to be super precise with your application, but overall it looked like a pretty standard color powder. Yeah, it's quite fair and the um, there's a little section that looks like it's almost uh, shimmery. Yeah. It doesn't really translate that well on the skin, no. but it does add a little bit of luminosity to the product. Next up, we have the Sailor Moon Miracle Romance Cosmic Heart Cheek Flat Style. So this is a stunning little heart-shaped uh, compact with a swirly pan of blush. So we actually really like this blush. Uh, the design goes all the way through. It's not an uh, overspray. And it's a really pretty sort of peachy pink shade. This one has a matte finish and the formula was really smooth as well. Next up, we have the Sailor Moon Miracle Romance Heart Cheek. So this is another blush. This one has a filigree pattern on it. We're going to see if it's an overspray. Spoiler, we know the answer. It's not good. Uh, the design on the top is an overspray. There it goes. Oh. See you later. Um, and it is a very, very light blush. So when it's swatched, it looks quite chalky. Yeah. Um, we were a little bit, we were wondering if it was the white overspray that caused the chalkiness. So we did a second swatch without the overspray. It is light and chalky all the way through. It is. A little bit shimmery. This one is the Sailor Moon Miracle Romance Makeup Eyeshadow Flat Style. So this is a quad eyeshadow. Ah, the little eyeshadow quad. This surprised me. Now, look, the color story, probably not something that we're going to be writing home about, but these swatched beautifully. Yeah, especially the dark brown and that mm -hmm. sort of ready coral color was quite surprising. It Gorgeous. cracked a bit of a punch. Yeah. So uh, it's a cute little quad and um, it does perform fairly well. Next up, we have the Miracle Romance Music Bok 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 <laughs> This one is the Miracle Romance Music Box of Starlit Sky Shiny Cream. Now this comes in two variations. There's a pink and a gold. Packaging is cute. So damn cute. Ah, these cheeky buggers. So we were wondering if these were different colors. I actually spent a, an unacceptably long time trying to research these on the internet to work out if we needed both of them. And in the end, I was like, we just got to get them both. Just to prove a just point. Just to prove a point. So we swatched them and then we couldn't tell because it was kind of over an eyeshadow swatch. That brown packed a punch. So then we swatched them again and we came to the conclusion that they are the same. If they're not identical, they're so close, you don't need them both. Correct. But the packaging is super cute. Absolutely. So uh, if you do like cream sort of glittery yeah. highlighter shades, pick up one. Pick up your favorite color. These also seem to set to like a dry touch finish, which yeah. was great. They're not greasy. No. This one is the Miracle Romance Communicator Lip Gloss Set. Those, so this is a five piece tinted lip gloss set that you can put on a wristband like a watch yeah. and wear it like an absolute boss. 
you can. Or you can be an extra boss and wear them all at once. <laughs> all right, so these lip balms, they do have a tint to them. It's quite translucent for most of them. The Venus one does look a little bit orange. The Mercury has a slight blue tint. It would appear quite clear on the skin, but there is a minute tint of blue. Tiny bit, yeah. Tiny, yep. tiny, tiny. Jupiter's similar with a bit of a green tint. These all don't have a scent either. No, so, so I was so bummed. I was hoping they'll all have different scents and this one will be like mint or something. We we're going to have to get another one of these and like yeah. walk around with our dorky little wristbands full of lip balms. <laughs> yeah, like, I would have loved it. Yeah. Uh, the only one that packed a punch with pigment was Mars. You can Mar see that this gold. is quite a red tinted lip balm. I know we called this a party balm. Party. Then Moon is a bit of a candy pink. So once again, not much color on the lips, but it is a cool toned pink. Next up, we have the Miracle Romance Lip and Cheek Tints. These come in five shade variations. Sorry to disappoint you, we only have four. So we have Sailor Moon, Sailor Mercury, Sailor Mars, and Sailor Venus. Okay, so these are a little bit different from the lip balms. These are lip and cheek products. They do have more pigment to them. Oh, pigment. She's beautiful. So this is Mars yep. and it's a beautiful corally pink shade and isn't as glossy as the lip balms. No. Mars, you're red. Indeed. Similar, swatched, <laughs> but more red. You're beautiful. Moon is sort of similar to the first coral shade, but it's more pink. So it's a warm toned pink. Venus is a beautiful orange. If you love a bit of a peachy cheek um, or a orangey warm lip, this one is beautiful. Swatch your ways, blend it out, Haley. Let's see what it looks like. It gets stuck on my hair, I can tell you. <laughs> Spoiler alert. They actually uh, blended quite easily. And I, look, it's always hard blending on the arm. Like I said, it does get stuck in the hair. It makes it look a little bit patchy. And I think that's a bit unfair to these products because they actually felt really nice. Yeah, and even though the colors when swatched, you can see a lot of similarities, um, they do offer something slightly different. Yeah. So you don't need them all, but if you are wanting to collect. I don't blame you. I don't blame you either. Next we have the Miracle Romance Jewel Rouge. Now these are lipsticks. We have Black Lady and Princess Serenity. And they're so cute. They're, they're so like cute. dresses. My gold. Dance Look, dresses, they're, they're dance. Going, they're going to have dance. All right, Princess Serenity, we kind of expected from the packaging for it to be a lot more nude. Yeah. Seems to be almost like a muted strawberry shade. Yeah. So it does have some red tones to it, um, but it is quite muted. It's not super, super pigmented, but it is one that if you blotted it down, it would look quite natural. Yeah. Black Lady is beautiful. This oh, is yeah. a lot more punchy with the pigment and it's a dark berry, like, almost like a boysenberry yeah. type shade. Very pretty. These are the Miracle Romance Hensu pens. So these are liquid eyeliners. They come in five types, but again, we've only got four. So Sailor Mercury is a navy blue. Then we have Sailor Mars, which is a burgundy. Sailor Jupiter is green and Sailor Venus is a brown. Let's see how these bad boys swatch. These have a really cute little extra cap that you can put on over the original cap as well. The first one is brown, but it actually swatches very, very dark. Yeah, it looks almost black. Almost black, very pigmented. One good thing about this type of brown is that it's a little bit more toned down than a black, but it still really emphasizes the eye shape that you're trying to create. So very smooth, really beautiful. Burgundy. My God, we're clearly both going to need one of them. Yeah. Stunning, stunning, stunning. We stunning. love a burgundy liner here, beauty news. The green was very interesting. It's very surprising. It's a murky forest green, I yeah, would call it's, it. It's like a dark olive. Yeah. Um, I sort of expected from the packaging that it would be a really bright green, but it's not. The blue was strange in formula. Yeah. It applied one... nicely, but initially it appeared like it was beating up and pulling away on the skin. Yeah, it wasn't settling on yes. the skin very well. It was 
sort of fighting the skin a little yeah, bit. Yeah. But when you did build it up, it did become quite bold and yep. pretty, but it was probably the formula that I liked the least. So we did leave these two set and here I am playing with the texture of them. So these have a shiny finish, but they almost, you can feel them on the skin. So they, they have this sort of raised feeling on the skin. It's not super obvious, but you can feel it. Yeah, it's almost like it's a layer of paint rather yeah. than ink that yeah. sort of sinks into the skin. Correct, yeah. And then we gave it a good old rub test. Now, I can't say uh, it stood up to it, but I was rubbing my hand or my yeah. arm pretty, pretty hard. I expect a little bit more from my liners, but yeah. the colors are pretty. They are. Last but certainly not least, we have the Miracle Romance Makeup Tint Gloss. So these are color adjusting lip glosses. They come in five shades. We have we them have all. Them all. Woo Woo. So we have Sailor Moon, Sailor Venus, Sailor Mars, Sailor Mercury, and Sailor Jupiter. Okay, it appears like we're swatching Venus first, which is the sort of yellow toned one. Yeah goes on yellow you can see by the doe foot applicator it's gonna turn pink mm -hmm. spoiler alert it's, it, turning it's pink. doing it now it's doing it right in front of our eyes all right you can tell by the purple wand that this is mercury so it's a blue one but it's turning pinky purple next we have the moon which is pink so pink turns pink not surprised Jupiter applies green and then starts to develop to a pink. Mars applies like a dark pink. It sort of looks like a dark pinky red in the tube and develops to more of a pink. Now let's leave them for a while and see if the pink ends up looking the same throughout all swatches. So you can see that they're all pink after letting them set for a while, but they're all a little bit different. I would say the blue one is most different. You yeah. could call that purple, but then we wipe away the swatches. You can see underneath, they're all pink. Yeah, so the gloss temporarily uh, sort of tweaks, yeah. tweaks the color of the pink. Um, the green one, for example, mutes it down a bit. The yellow one makes it look a little bit more orange, but at the core of it, the color is the same. It develops to the same pink. That is what will be left on your lips. All right, guys. So that's it for our little Get Swatched video. And we voiceover, woo! And voiceover, yeah! Look at us go, being professional and stuff. <laughs> uh, we hope Something you, like that. Yeah, look, we tried. <laughs> We hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you are a Sailor Moon fan and you have tried any of these Korea Beauty products, let us know what you tried and what was your fave. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.